Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the first time in my corner of the internet. My name is Timmy. For those you don't know me, I upload travel style and beauty videos here on YouTube. And today is an exciting day because your girl is headed to Hawaii. Um, it's my first time ever going to like any part of Hawaii. We're going to Oahu, um, so like Honolulu, Waikiki, that that area. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited. It is real early this morning. I woke up around like 2 a.m. It's now almost 3. Um, my sister's on her way to come pick me up and then we have to drive to Long Beach because that's where we're flying out of. Um, so we have like a five and a half, six hour drive to Long Beach and then um, our flight over to Oahu. Um, but yeah, welcome to the Hawaii vlogs. <music> finally made it to Hawaii. We are now walking to get some food. We literally haven't really eaten today. Had a breakfast burrito at like nine o'clock this morning. Yeah, like nine, 10 o'clock this morning and haven't eaten since really. So we are on our hunt for some masubi and pokey. Hopefully this place is good. It was recommended by one of my coworkers, so. Alright, so we just went to the Masubi Cafe. Um, I got a few different things. I got a teriyaki spam masubi, um, this like shrimp tapura spicy something, and then like a little salmon or rice ball. So we're just out here at the beach. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. The weather cleared up, which is so nice because it was like drizzling earlier, so now it's feeling a lot better. But um, yeah. But, um, we're gonna try our first masubi here in, is it masubi? Masubi? Masube? I don't know. You know what I'm talking about. Little spam rice ball. Oh! This is a teriyaki one. So first masubi in Hawaii. Mm. I think so. It's pretty darn good. It's a lot of rice. I think I would prefer like less rice. The meat to rice ratio is a little off, but it's still good. So now we have the salmon or rice ball. You got to cook it. You want to And this is Destiny. This is my niece. <laughs> Was this mangang? No. <laughs> Damn. That would be great. actually like our first full day though. Um, this morning we just woke up and got some breakfast at a, like a little spot uh, near our hotel. Now we are at the Maka, Makapuyu Lighthouse Trail. <laughs> I don't, I'm gonna leave it right here because I, this entire vlog series is gonna be me just mispronouncing things. I'm, I'm gonna try my best, but let's just, <laughs> yeah. Anyways, um, so yeah, we have this hike and then a couple other things to like check out and then we're gonna go back to our hotel and get ready for dinner. We're going to, I think it's called Hol 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 Holoia Joe's, something like that. Um, but yeah, you have to get there like super early in order to get a table. So um, after we're done like looking at a few points over here, we're gonna go back to the hotel, get ready for that dinner um, and then head that way. Um, but yeah, that is the game plan for today. Um, it's actually pretty breezy, pretty nice out right now. It's not too bad. 
Um, it is a little muggy, so my asthma might trigger a little bit, and of course, I don't have my inhaler, but other than that, it should be a good day. <laughs> guys so we made it to the restaurant we have about an hour and a half wait um so we're gonna go explore the gardens while we wait for our table um but yeah it is absolutely stunning like just look at that so beautiful so lush and green it's wild because like on like the waikiki side it's very like city and urban um but on this like where we're at right now it's very green very lush and this is kind of like the hawaii i was expecting um not that the rest of it isn't beautiful but this is just like when people say hawaii this is what i picture um so yeah i'm so hungry though <laughs> like i'm getting a little hangry um i could really eat some food but i'm sure it's worth the wait Alright guys, so we just finished up at dinner. It was super good. Everything was delicious. Highly, highly recommend checking out this place if you're in Oahu. Um, but yeah, we're just back down by the little like gazebo on the water because uh, my sister didn't get a chance to see it earlier. Um, so yeah, we're just back down here. Probably gonna snap a few pictures and then head back to Waikiki. <laughs> Good morning guys. Um, it is day three here in Hawaii. We are trying to find some caffeine. We were gonna to go to Island Vintage Cafe, um, but the line was really, really long and we're trying to get out and get hiking before it gets super hot. So we're just gonna to go to the Starbucks Reserve. Um, that's right next to our hotel and then head out. We are heading to the, I think it's the Windward Coast. Um, we're gonna do like the Lanikai Pillbox hike and then hang out at the beach for the day. Um, then also get some breakfast slash brunch. Um, so yeah, that's kind of the gameplay for today. And then we also have our luau uh, later on tonight. This is literally so good. It is so good. <laughs> it's like fresh and warm and like crispy. 10 out of 10. <laughs> I like that as well. It's good. It's like healthy mocha. I like it. Alright guys, so we tried to do the pillbox hike and it was so busy. Like there was like no parking whatsoever. There's all these signs about like where you can and can't park and all this other stuff. So like we're gonna try it again. Today's Sunday. Um, so we're gonna try it again on like a weekday and see if it'll be better. Um, and then also try to get here like a lot earlier so that would be my suggestion is that if you're going to try to do the lanikai pillbox hike definitely get there early um so now we're just gonna grab breakfast at kono's um i've heard really good things so should be good what is what is life right now guys i we got donuts earlier at this place and i somehow lost my wallet like i went into kono's to pay for my lunch and literally couldn't because <laughs> my wallet wasn't in my bag and I was like well maybe I left it at the hotel like maybe I didn't put it in the bag and then I remembered no I bought a donut so I definitely had my wallet and so I started to like panic I was like oh great I've lost my wallet my ID's in there I don't know how I'm gonna get on this plane back home <laughs> but luckily um luckily somebody turned it into the hotel I must have dropped it in the parking garage or something so thank god everything's okay we just gotta go back to the hotel and get my wallet but your girl was gonna start panicking but all is well. God, God was looking out today. So this is just the day of things not working out. Um, so <laughs> we were supposed to go hang out on the beach and everything. Um, but my sister started not feeling well, so we came back to our hotel. 
Um, and now we're just kind of like walking around um, our hotel because it's where like the big like mall is and stuff. So I'm just out walking around with my knees. Um, we're probably gonna grab some coffee and then head back to the room and start getting ready for our luau. Um, so the luau is at 5.30. They want you there at five and it's about 30 minutes away. So we're gonna leave at like 4.15. So we have about like an hour to kind of like hang out for a little bit. Um, and then we're gonna um, go get ready for that. So yeah, things are not really working out the way that they were uh, meant to, but we're having a good time. We're still here, so. Me and Destiny are hitting the trail today. <laughs> um, Nick's in bed. She's not feeling well, but we decided to still do the hike. So we're at Diamond Head. Should take us about 45 minutes to an hour to get up to the top, and then another 45 to get back down. But it is 6:48 in the morning. We've had like. 30 minutes of sleep, maybe. <laughs> the other <laughs> hours were spent in plastic chairs, uh, sleeping against walls. Because <laughs> um, we had to go to the hospital last night um, just to make sure everything was okay. And yeah, so we got there like 11.30 maybe? 11.30, almost midnight, and then get out till 4.50, and then woke up at like 5.30 to get here to do the hike. So. We definitely stopped at Starbs to get some caffeine and hopefully we'll make it to the top and not pass out from exhaustion. Mm -hmm. But anyways, the incline is picking up. So I'll see you at the top. So we finished up at Diamond Head and then made our way to Ars Cafe, which was like mm, like six minutes away. Um, it was like highly recommended. So went there. I got a cold brew and it's like, it's good. Um, it's like real smooth. Um, I just put a little bit of cream in it. Um, so it's just like very like coffee forward um, and it's good. But I had a triple espresso earlier this morning when we woke up because it had been... Um, um, I had a triple espresso this morning from Starbucks because it was like downstairs of our hotel and I was like I need some caffeine to be able to make it up this mountain. So this is like my second coffee of the day and it's only 9.43. Um, so yeah, I'm like taking this one slowly because I don't want to like over caffeinate myself. Um, but yeah, so I got this and then I also got a salmon lox bagel and when I tell you that this is like the best salmon lox bagel that I've ever had, it is like so good and like so fresh and just... Mm, it's so good um so yeah we're just at long's drugs which is like a cvs here in hawaii um picking up a prescription for my sister um and then we're gonna head back to the hotel so the plan for today is go back to the room we might try to rest up a little bit we have to go to um pearl harbor today but that's not until three o'clock um so we have a couple hours we might like go back rest up a little bit and then get back out there or um i don't know like i'm not like i'm tired but like i can keep going you know so we'll see i might take a quick like little power nap or something um shower um uh, from like after the hike and whatnot and then go from there um but yeah so that's like the current situation i'm just waiting for destiny to get back so that way we can head back to the hotel what's up guys so 
it's been a few hours um i think the last i checked in we had just finished up with our hike and getting some breakfast um we came back to the room and kind of passed out for a few hours because we were just exhausted um so we took a nice long nap and then we made our way to pearl harbor um but then we missed our boat like literally um i guess at three o'clock um or we had reservations for three o'clock and then anyways so we had reservations at three o'clock and got there at like 3 10 so um it's not like one of those like oh just get here in this general time it's like be here at that time so we miss pearl harbor but now we're on our way to happy hour to get drinks and oysters <laughs> So we just got back from Leonard's. Um, I got six different flavors. I'm excited to try them. Um, everybody raves about these things. So I got, I think, custard, coconut, cinnamon, sugar, blueberry, and guava. If that's six, that's what I got. Um, yeah, I'm super excited to try these out.